we do something special at Notre Dame, he said, and, and they get out and they do this little cheer. Like this, you know, I'm here to do it. UH football coach Greg McMacken is feeling the heat tonight after making some controversial comments. Good evening and thanks for having us in. Coach McMacken made that comment during a news conference in Salt Lake City. McMacken immediately apologized for his choice of words and mocking the dance skills of Notre Dame's football team, but by then the damage was done. KITV's Catherine Cruz begins team coverage with tonight's top story. Catherine? Well, you know, Gary and pa Pam, the fallout started early at 6.30 this morning when UH, uh, UH Athletic Director Jim Donovan got a phone call from the WAC Commissioner about the incident. Donovan then called Coach Mack to explain himself. The story took off from there. Coach McMacken used a six-letter derogatory word, offensive to gays. He was describing a kind of cheer performed by the Notre Dame football players at the UH Hawaii Bowl game. We do something special at Notre Dame, he said, and, and they get out and they do this little cheer. Like this, you know, I'm here for the He immediately apologized. But what I was trying to do is be funny, and it wasn't funny. And it's not funny, and, and, and even more, it isn't funny. Coach Max bosses didn't think it was funny either. I'm angered and disappointed by the statement attributed to Coach McMacken this morning. It certainly does not represent uh, the values of the University of Hawaii. I've spoken with Coach Mack, and he realizes he made a serious mistake. He's extremely apologetic, and I have to admit, it's not in keeping with what I've seen from Coach Mack throughout the time I've worked with him. It's very respectful of all people. Coach Mack is being urged to meet with students and clubs who may have been offended by his comments when he returns. University administrators declined to talk about any disciplinary action, but the Board of Regents will take up the issue behind closed doors at its next meeting. But in the celebrated football coach's contract, there is a clause that says causing notorious or public scandal is cause for termination. But some students aren't so sure the slur sanctions should be so harsh. If you say something like that, you don't necessarily mean, like, I hate gay people or, you know, I, I have these views about this certain group of people. I think maybe it was meant as kind of a, 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 a diss on the dance. Coach Mack is the highest paid state employee at a salary of more than a million a year, and some have suggested that a fine should be in the picture. Now coming up at 6, I'll have more on what lawmakers think about McMack and said, plus reaction from the local gay community. Catherine Cruz, KRTV4 Island Television News.